faces you and you don't know what to do just yell out loud good and loud mighty mouse with his strength he conquers all he will answer every call yell out loud good and loud mighty mouse In our last episode, we left Mighty Mouse bound and gagged on the Mojave Desert, entirely surrounded by vultures. The old colonel, Pearl Purehot's father, had just been tossed off the Brooklyn Bridge, and far below, the East River was swarming with crocodiles. And who was responsible for all this crime? Why, it is none other than that foul villain, Oil Can Harry. Yes, and you ain't seen nothing yet. Meanwhile, on top of the Empire State Building, in her beautiful penthouse, Pearl Pureheart, the Colonel's daughter, sings. Father, dear father, come home to me now. The clock in the steeple strikes one. You said you were coming right home from the shop. Sweet one. I can Harry. Yes, and with a string of pearls for you. So you tempt me with a string of pearls. Is that the way you win your girls? A very charming bride you'd make. Please marry me for goodness sake. Get out. You are a fake. <laughs> Where are you? Come to your boyfriend. Ah, oh, at last I have you in my arms. You're wonderful. You're beautiful. Kiss me, my little one. Relax. You are so tense, my sweet. Curses! <laughs> Mighty Mouse for lunch today. Hooray! Hooray! Oh no, you don't! Father, dear father, oh where are you now? I'm still falling down to the crocodiles.